when I go into an investment, when I'm looking around the property and I see a lot of concrete and land improvement, I, I am, get very excited <laughs> because yeah. I get to you. <laughs> and so um, is that a good way to look at it? I mean, obviously you don't want to buy um, parking lots and uh, that sort of thing just because, but if, if you find out they're a good investment, is that a, a good way to look at it? Yeah, I think it's always a benefit. I, I think you got to toe the line of, you know, never make an investment for a tax benefit or for a depreciation deduction. Uh, but I think as you're looking to divest and, and get into other investment opportunities, you do start to look at the building and say, OK, what what is the potential benefit of this? Um, again, look, if you're walking through a facility and there's a lot of carpet flooring, and there's a lot of decorative millwork. So crown molding and, and and chair rail, if there's cabinetry involved, um, those are really good items on the interior. You know, again, medical buildings, you know, you have a lot of electrical serving equipment. You've got, uh, depending on the medical building, you've got HVAC systems that serve the medical community. Um, again, self-storage facilities are they're home runs in terms of speeding up depreciation deductions. So, yeah, 